just the way it goes. During the hearings, Smith and Howarth take depositions from various witnesses. To prove that Lafferty is unfit as an executor, they get access to Doris Duke's credit card statements. Before uh, Miss Duke even died, while she was in her last illness, uh, Mr. Lafferty took her credit cards. He went out on several binges of spending and drinking on Rodeo Drive in Beverly Hills. He bought diamond-studded earrings, or at least one of them. He bought a gold watch for $35,000. He did not have a driver's license, but he, in a drunken state, crashed her car into the Whiskey Yacht Go-Go in, uh, in Hollywood. So Mr. Lafferty was completely out of control before she had died. He was almost childlike in his enjoyment. Like he, you know, he was not a well educated man. This was more than he had ever thought of in terms of access to money. But yes, he did try to enjoy uh, what had been given him. And he was entitled to do that, in my opinion. That's my head, dude. He did some things. That's my head, dude. He did. <laughs> probably retrospect.